We are learning that there are now three investigations underway into a sex scandal and alleged cover-up involving two state representatives. State Representative Todd Corser is one of the people right in the middle of that scandal. Here's what he had to say today to 7 Investigator Jim Kirchner. State Rep Todd Corser wants investigators to look at his former aides, including one who secretly recorded him that made the scandal public. Corser wants to know if it was eavesdropping or wiretapping, and did they send him texts threatening to out him unless he resigned. Corser says he will be exonerated. I've met with the state police, I've met with the FBI, I've also met with the, um, the House Business Office, and I'll continue, obviously, to, to uh, cooperate however we can. Only seven Action News cameras are rolling as the other state rep in this sex and cover-up scandal, Cindy Gamrat, came to the House floor for roll call. She did not take any media questions. She has said she won't resign and has done nothing wrong. Corser previously admitted to sending an email to fellow Republicans in May with a fake story that he was caught having sex with a male prostitute to deflect from his alleged affair with Gamrat. Did he do that on the taxpayer's dime? Could that be a crime? There was nothing illegal in, in regards to that as far as use of, or misuse of state funds. It was on private property in the evening off state hours. So um, I think there'll be a Was it on a state computer? No. This former He's staffer, nice Josh to Klein, to both Corser and Gamrat, held a news conference yesterday to say they carried on rather often than doing their work as the legislators. Branch. And the moment of truth was in February when Gamrat's husband discovered them at a Lansing hotel. I have no reaction, Josh Klein. I didn't hear it, I didn't listen to it. Corser and Gamrat have apologized for indiscretions and bad decisions, but neither one has confirmed they had an extramarital affair. That led to the cover up and the bigger scandal. I'm asking you to clarify right now. No, I'm not. Uh, you, you can go and look. You're, you're welcome to do that. I, did. I get it. It's a, I did. it's a reporter gotcha. I got it. And sources tell us the House investigation will run all this week with interviews with staffers involved in this case. In Lansing, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Now, with the scandal 